moments this turns into this kill you and hold it you fucked with the wrong guy my Following today's incredibly messy truck series race, there was a fight between Matt Crafton and Nick Sanchez, and you saw some of the video at the beginning of this video. For obvious reasons, I blurred out Nick's face because it was it was a little bit of a mess. Uh, for those of you that are squeamish, probably wouldn't have wanted to see that anyways. This all seemingly started when Crafton tried to go for a spot on the track that just wasn't there and Sanchez seemed to fill it. Now the question is, who's at fault for this on-track incident? Is it Crafton? Is it Sanchez? I'm leaning more towards the side of Crafton, but let me know what you think in the comments below. This can be debated back and forth. It, uh, overall though, it is a racing incident. It's just, it's the stuff that's gonna happen at Talladega. Following the fight, we did get word from Sanchez out of the infield care center. Here's a video from tobychristie.com. Yeah, I mean, I was walking back to the hauler, tapping my back, got punched in the face. Uh, cheap shot. Yeah. Something else to note here too, is that Crafton did not finish this race that wreck got him out of the event while Sanchez was able to continue and finish the race with significant damage. So Crafton waited until the race was over to confront Nick Sanchez and if what Nick said is true, there was no attempt at a conversation, he was tapped on the shoulder, he turned around and he was punched. Final question we have to ask ourselves is, is there gonna be a penalty for this? Well, my thought process is I am assuming that Matt Crafton will be issued a penalty, whether it's a suspension, monetary fine points thing, I don't really know, but if Nick's side of the story is true, granted we don't have any footage as far as I know of how this all started, I'm assuming that Matt is going to get a penalty. Though we also know what Nick said at the end of that fight video was also a lot. That seems very uncharacteristic for Nick as well, but I don't know if anything will come out of that. I have so many thoughts on this, but I'm gonna leave it here. What do you all think about this post-race fight between Nick Sanchez and Matt Crafton? Let me know in the comments below.